Hi guys, so today I have a quick haul uh, from Crafters Companion. I watched a show maybe last week, I don't know. I really like to go on there just to kind of get ideas of how to use the stuff I already have. Plus, um, sometimes I have some great deals so I end up buying some things and then I like to chat. So now they actually have a moderator in the chat and then lots of people that come to see my channel. And a lot of people there saying I bought this because of you or I saw your video then uh, I fell in love with the, like, the fairy garden or different collections and it's always nice. And it's kind of funny because even now the uh, the moderator there on the Crafters Companion, she always says hi to me just because I'm there, you know, so <laughs> that's kind of sweet. Um, and then I got, like, I think I might mention to you guys, uh, she's like, oh, I should go check out your channel since everyone keeps uh, mentioning it. And I'm like, oh, sure. <laughs> but it's kind of a, I don't know, I always feel weird when companies come over to see my channel. But, um, you know, because I give my honest opinion, guys. So <laughs> it might be rough sometimes and sometimes it's great, right? So I do want to apologize if you guys watch the... Oh, yeah. The ultimate craft card, ma sorry, ultimate card making compendium uh, auto ship video where I made this card. It's uh, for the auto ship, the first one from that uh, big box, and it's called the um, ultimate die compendium, which is kind of a kind of a lofty name for what's in there. But anyway, um, I made this card, and it's cute, and I like it, and it came out great. And my camera was like zooming in 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 slowly 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 i don't know what it was doing it glitched out completely on that video i was looking at other videos i made four videos yesterday or whenever i had made them and they were all fine but that was the last video i made and i don't know what my camera was doing so i'm gonna have to keep an eye on my camera making sure it's not doing that funky thing i'm so sorry if it made you guys feel like woozy or weird or i mean it wasn't too bad it was very slowly incrementally moving in but it was weird and i don't know why i did it for all those three or four takes that i have to do for, for that video right so i apologize and um hopefully it doesn't happen again i've been trying to test it out like why i did that and it's fine right now so i, I don't know hi this camera i'm gonna tell you right now was not cheap i mean i bought it years ago and i think it was like 700 bucks and that was because it was an open box at best buy uh for one of these 4k cameras so it, you know, I'd hate to have to buy another one, but, um, I don't know. Um, we'll see. Hopefully it was just glitching out for some reason. And I just opened the box. It was a big box and I showed you guys in the last video it was sitting there and I just realized it has this right on top and oh my gosh, this gets my nerves because, <laughs> um, with compliments. I don't know what that means. There has been a stock discrepancy on our website and currently out of stock of the highlighted item. If you're happy to wait, we'll automatically send the missing item as soon as they're back in stock. But I've never seen that happen. So this one's not saying they refunded me, it just says the item is out of stock. It does say to follow. Oh, there's a couple things. So I'm not getting the easy mount acrylic storage panels, full size with tabs, which I wanted. And the the stamp folder that goes along with it, so that's kind of interesting. Large die and stamp folder with two packs of acrylic panels. So it's basically that folder set. Um, I reviewed it. They're a large folder, right? You know how they have a purple folder. And inside it you can either put um, die magnetic die sheets or the uh, white kind of panels where you stick your stamps to basically a cling stamp um, or excuse me acrylic stamps will stick to it um, and so those things kind of go hand in hand and apparently they're not here but like I just said they did write on here oops, the words to follow S times five I don't know what that means five five two five I'm going to have to call them obviously we'll see what happens because I would like to have them at the same time, they weren't the best price. I think I got the last time I ordered them cheaper. And I did not get any more of the magnetic mats. You guys, the pages, you know, I, I didn't really like them. They were a little bit flimsy. Um, one of the gals here said that hers were the same way. And then she ended up calling them. And um, I guess they offered to send her another set. Because they said they never heard that from anybody before. And, um, and they're just going to send her another set. So I don't know what that does. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So um, they are thin. All right. So I did get this guy... Um, which you all know, I could just keep waiting and I'm sure get a better price, but it was $15.99 and this is the newest um, Crafters Inspiration, so I was happy to get this. Um, a lot of times they'll have them on sale for like 3 bucks if you buy, you know, the, this one plus the previous one, the previous one from that, so it'll be like $10 for 3 of them or $15 for 3 of them. So I went ahead and got it because that's still a better price than I would have paid normally anyway or even on HSN. So let's see what is in this guy. I think everything else is kind of boring, you guys. We'll have to see. I don't remember what I ordered. <laughs> like I said, I usually order like on a Wednesday or maybe Thursday. That way, whatever they had on earlier in the week on crafterscompanion.com or Crafters TV, I can still kind of get in on those deals if they haven't sold out, right? So I like to just place one order, but do however you like. So it comes with this nice little stamp set with these cute little flowers. 
and it says thank you and a lot of other little sentiments there. Um, it has this little paper craft die and this one does not have an edge so you can keep running it if you want up and down an edge of a paper or however big your paper happens to be. It doesn't have an edge here on the sides so it just cuts this top part off. And then this little tag does completely cut out and has a little um, a little hole there so I guess you can make it an actual tag. It comes with this um, Crafters Inspiration issue 25 sick digital collections and they look very cute. There's a By the River, Easter Treats, Florida Lights, Nautical Collection, Superheroes, Vintage Valentine, which looks really cute. And then they show some of the pages or papers that are in there. Look at this little guy. So cute. I like this a lot. And um, oh, interesting. Cause usually it has a double set and then it has like how to do something with like the Gemini or something. So this is all just um, images and papers and uh, hundreds of printable papers it says and all kinds of stuff like that so cute and I have a video where I've gone and used their actual stuff and it works out really great so this is oh I guess maybe this is instead of the video it says uh, no line coloring velvet teen technique mixed media effects part one an introduction to spectrum noir so this is probably in place of the other DVD or CD step-by-step -step guides and it has different techniques you can do with some of the different inks and stuff. So that's cool. And then we have the magazine, of course. And the magazine has doesn't have any kind of like ads in it normally, I don't think. Um, <laughs> after I said I'm like, what do they? Because it's basically their own product and they put this together so that you can make different things, obviously with what's in the kit, but also with their products, right? And then what's in the, um, the DVD. Pretty cool, cute stuff. So that was good. I'm glad to have that because uh, I always like to pick up their magazine. Do, do, do. Put this over here. Uh, what else is in here? There's. Oh, I bought another fo uh, foam rolls. And none of these things go are there. Just get them. I mean, with my discount, I think this is nine bucks for twelve foam rolls, and this foam is really great. So I like to work with it. So I went ahead and grabbed another one because why not? As I say, this is a very small order. And I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> okay, well, okay. I think this was a show maybe with Sarah. Oh yeah, so glue tape pens. There's 12 in here. This is like if I ordered them because I had a, a business or something. Look at this. So they were, I think, buy six and get six free, basically. So I think for this whole box I paid... It was not cheap, guys, because there's 12 of them. I paid 26 bucks, and that's with my discount. So basically, two bucks each, a little over two bucks each my tons of <laughs> glue pens so it's not very as I'm saying, it's a little bit boring my order here but um good stuff still what is this this is oh okay so they have the shaker card kit which obviously I already got because I'm uh do their subscription but this is basically just another shaker box kit for 12 bucks you guys I can't pass that up so even if I were to give away the dies because obviously I already have the dies and they last forever um I did pick up another shaker card kit and I will keep all the other yummy fun stuff that's in here but I will definitely probably not, not definitely probably that doesn't those go against each other don't they I will definitely give away the dies and the stamps um, do something with that really cute sets in there anyway so you guys can enjoy that and the last thing that's what I was saying I think I got this because Sarah must have had a show or something where she was doing something on here because this is another kind of like that taste of coloring kit, but this one was called Coloring Discovery Kit. If you guys remember um, during their birthday week, she had one called Taste of Coloring. And so this one uh, is similar, I guess. But let's see what's in here. Similar, but not really, because I can see already this is not exactly the same. Awesome. So I did get some classiques, which I have not tried yet because they're basically the regular ones. This is what was in that last Taste of Color they gave me. Um, these guys, right? The just regular Spectrum Noir. The old school ones, right? And which are great. The hexagon shape, that's fine. But they reformulated. Supposedly the ink is reformulated, but it's the same nib and, you know, the nibs that they have. So that's why this is the classic. And then they have the illustrator and they have like sketch and they have other names. But, um, I think it was sketch or portrait. I can't remember. But I like the illustrator one. So I pretty much have all of my illustrators except for one blue one I'm still like not getting so uh, I always check their website to see if it's back in stock so I just need one blue pen and then I'll have the whole set basically so there's a taste of coloring so it comes with these greens so that's cool 
Um, it comes with an aqua blend in earth tones, and I do have some aqua blends. I don't believe I have this one because I would never buy something like this. Like, oh, I need that green and brown one, you know? Oops, let me go turn off this. Uh, hold on. Oh my gosh, the day flew by. I was watching HSN, all that stuff, but okay. So aqua blend with the earth tones, and they're just kind of like earth tones. So cool to have this because like I said I wouldn't have picked up that colorway anyway. Um, the glitter brush pens which are really fun. I need to do more with this stuff guys because I have tons of them. I have pretty much all of them. <laughs> and so this is the spring and summer set um, to do some more you know techniques and you guys can kind of see how they work. Spectrum Noir Metallics and Rare Minerals. I will definitely give these away. I don't know if I have these but um, I hardly ever do hand lettering and stuff like that so I think this is something that other people might enjoy so I will definitely give that set away. Um, it comes with a blending tool. Oh, let me tell you, this was 24 bucks. I guess they probably wanted 30, so with my discount, it's 24. Oh, so this is one of my favorite colors, and I use this all the time, so I do not mind having this. It is a little bit open here at the fuchsia. Um, but this is opaque pigment, which I don't really have. I only have the metallic ones and the white one, which is not good. So um, I'm looking forward to trying that out. We have some uh, the aqua tints, um, glitz and glamour, it's called. I don't know if I have these. I have the other sparkle. Yeah, I have the sparkle ones. They're right behind me. I can see them. So I don't have, I don't know if I bought aqua tints before. So maybe they were in the taste of coloring last bag, goodie bag, but I don't know. And then she did mention it was going to have paper. So we have watercolor card 15 sheets right here. And it feels really nice. I can feel it through the plastic here. And then Nina uh, Classic Crest card um, uh, 16 sheets. So. And it is solar white, so it's ultra smooth solar white. I always look forward to that. So not bad. I mean, for 24 bucks, so there's only one. Really, not any repeats. I mean, eh. I guess you can consider some of these things repeats, but that's okay, because um, they'll work out for me. So I think that's all I have for you guys right now. I don't think I've ordered anything else from them. Hopefully, like I said, very soon they will have the Crafty Fun collection on HSN. I think they... Not on HSN. They already launched on HSN, but on... Um, Crafters Companions website in case you missed it or didn't pick it up or if you want to buy piece by piece instead of like the big kits like they were selling on HSN. I think it's going to be available in um, f on February 3rd. Check on the 2nd though because I can't remember if it was 2nd or 3rd. Okay, so check on the 2nd, check on the 3rd. Uh, the Lily Collection, I still don't really know when it's going to be available but I'm sure I didn't hear them say they weren't bringing it to their site so I don't know but hopefully you guys got that one. It was a really pretty collection and um, I'll see you guys at the next one. Bye now.